Okay, well, welcome everybody to a, another week of the Formula G Challenge here in Formula 2, where I'm competing as a backup driver. Uh, this week we are in France. Uh, I already played my reserve driver role in the regular uh, map, so to speak. Uh, did very well. Uh, France is not too hard, especially with five minutes. Um, but let's see how I can do in a non-moving challenge. Oh, we haven't put up the best scores at all. Uh, but France might give us something. I say that, but... The, uh, the regular maps have been doing a really good job of giving you signs or something close to your spawn point. But um, this moving, on the other hand... Uh, I don't know if he looks for locations that are uh, information heavy. Um, and we have like a pastures, we've got some, uh, some farms, rolling hills, very green, a bicycle path, so maybe not too far from a big city. Um, or a sort of somewhat area, I don't know. Um, let's see, uh, the thing is France does have or say this does count as well as a few overseas territories like Reunion Island so we do need to be careful if it looks tropical we do need to check out those islands um, this uh, I don't know this isn't this doesn't look like the south of France this looks more like somewhere in here maybe I don't know not bad sir lemons did very well uh, probably getting a little bit lucky just putting us in the middle of the country, so to speak. Um, not too far behind Snowfall, which should be expected. Uh, but yeah, I just get really unlucky with my, like, random location. Like, we knew the area, but where do I put myself, right? Oh, this is even worse. Um, edges rolling again. We're like in a cul-de-sac at the end of something where we have no vision. Um, older farms. I almost want to say this is like Brittany. But I don't know if that's actually true or not. Um, I mean, hell, we shouldn't be worried too much about it. Like, there's no information. Um, yeah. They almost look like British houses. It's kind of why I think we're more north. But oh, it was Brittany. Oh, man. Yeah, I was like, it was, we should have put ourselves in here. We would have done really well. Uh, I was like, yeah, but is it, but is it like way over here, Brittany? Or is it more this area? So, ah, uh, just, I just make bad choices with where to put my pin when I don't have much information. Um, I think our latitudes, probably what we want to say is are, are very good, but our longitude is, is not. A dirt road we can't see above the hedges. I mean, this feels like the same area of France again. Sure. Oh, it was. Um, up in that corner. Players so far. Ooh, maybe they guessed really far away. Because after... Oh, because after this round, we are third, and Ben doesn't count because he's the organizer. He's just playing to check out the seed, so. I don't know. that that The fact that those two dropped off the uh, the charts there is a little bit interesting. Um, okay, we're actually on a paved road for once. Not. But again, we've got these tall bushes, shrubs, trees, so to speak. Uh. The dashed roads tend to be very small, 
in France, so I doubt, like, even if we could see the number, we would have an easy time finding it. Again, rolling hills, high bushes. This doesn't feel like... I mean, the problem is, like, if you can even see on the map here, France isn't too diverse except for down here in the mountains. Um, here it starts to look like you know, river valleys and kind of things, but this whole area of farm is just rolling hills and whatnot, and it's just really hard. I always forget how close Guernsey and Jersey are to France. I always think they're up here somewhere, but they're actually right way down there. Um, anyway, um, I don't know. I think we kind of hedge our bets and just say we're... Because we could be anywhere in here. Oops. Anywhere in here. So if I put us somewhere in here, and we're not we're not close to Paris, I think. But we've got to kind of hedge our bets, right? We got to we go for all or nothing kind of when we've been coming up short in the last two matches, because we we go here, right? We're saying we are in, we're getting points if we're in this area. Now are we in that area? Are we more here? How how narrow can we get? We can't see anything. I don't really know what we're, we're all too worried about. Um, yeah, I'm I'm thinking northern half, right? Are we Brittany or something? We don't really have enough clues. We could be. I don't think we're towards Belgium. That's a little bit far. Okay, if we split the country. North half? Yes. Are we on west half or east half? Probably west half. Then we should probably put our marker over here. We were south. Okay, but as so far, we are second, which is pretty interesting here. We were really far south. Oh, and that little... Yeah, see this... this You can zoom out, too. This plains area, so to speak, winds all the way down. I probably should have put us maybe... Yeah... The problem is, it's, it's all too similar. Like, <laughs> we literally got five rounds of French countryside with rolling green hills and no signs. So, now these buildings don't look like British, Britain, Brit Brittany ones. They look more French. So maybe more south. Big windmills. I don't see lots of wine. More pasture. No. Um, I think we are already. This is where we might play a little bit of a, a strategy here against our opponents. We should play the man rather than the than the seed. Um, we know we're in second. If we hedge our bets for something like down here or over here, we could lose a thousand points to somebody who picked over here and we're off. Right? If we try to put ourselves dead center, um, the odds of us losing too many points and then being able to make a 2,000 point, 1,000 point comeback is smaller. We'll hedge our bets. We'll get like 3K no matter what. Even if they get 4K, we'll still have the advantage. That's kind of my thought here, is we should try to pick a location that'll give us 3k. More than 3k. We don't want under 3k. We want more. Now, we should use our previous spots as well. Does this look like a previous round? It sort of looks like maybe the first round or the last round. And those were both in this area. So let's put ourselves in here and hedge our bets. This video is going to be pretty short because I'm going to... Not much to work with here. I'm not looking for numbers or names like we did have. I think we had some names and stuff in Australia. Uh, but 
And we did we did have some in Spain, uh, but here we just got nothing to work with. So other than the geography itself, maybe some architecture. Um, it looks like a very warm. This does look like it does look like this area, though. Again, but they always look like this area, but it can be down here, too, which is kind of why I'm hedging my bets. OK, what do we do? Ooh, three, eight. That's that's what we wanted. As close to 4K as we can get. We were west. No, sorry, we were east backward. Um, But that interesting. We were that close to, to Switzerland. And it's that flat still. It's a little bit more mountainous, but that's still whatever. Three eights, very good. Nineteen thousand. Um, round four was our worst by far. But given the fact that we didn't have an island, which might have actually saved it. Because if it's on an island, it's pretty obvious that might have been a chance for us to really break away. But let's see how we do. We are in. We are in first. Holy cow, because uh, Ben's the organizer. He's just playing. He got he did a really good job of just clicking through in a few seconds. Um, Sir Lemon's also spent less than a minute on everything. And Snowfall, too. But we take first place this week. Um, I say that because the deadline is in about, oh, maybe 12 hours or so. And Sir Lemons and Snowfar are the big opponents we've got to face. We beat both of them. We're in top three. We've got Podium. I think we'll be picking up our first points of the season today. Uh, yeah, I love France a lot nicer than Spain or Australia. So definitely enjoying that. But yeah, well done. 4-3. What happened that we got a big advantage? We got 4-3 in our round three. And they got 1,000 points less. 1,000 points, almost identical, and then, yeah, Sir Lemons almost came back with a 4-6. But that was that was our round. Round 3 was what did it for us. Well, we, we said we know we're going to be north. And that got that got us our, our big difference that we, we were able to hold on to. Barely. 131 points there. But yeah, wow, I'm really happy with that one. Um... Uh, let me try to see if I can't pull up my uh, regular uh, Formula One race event and show you how that looks. Um, I think we beat both of our teammates. Here we go. Um, did that work? No, it didn't. Um, hang on. I have to bring this. I don't know. It's too difficult. I hate using full screen because I can't switch things easily. I can't talk about it. Um, we did have two rounds in Tropical Islands, which was really advantageous for us. We got 24,999. 24,000. Um, our teammates, 24,985. So we beat them by five points. And then Manislau, 23,952. We are 10th right now out of all the competitors, not just um, not just uh, the uh, what you call it, the uh, Formula Two drivers. So we're, we're up there with Formula One drivers in this in this season uh, in this week. Um, interesting to note as of right now, it looks like we have seven players getting a perfect score. So we are 10th, which means of the people who didn't get a perfect score, we're third, which is pretty good. We only lost 10 points ourselves. We did get three aces, um, which is just pretty much in line with um, of quite a few of the other players. Um, looks like the fastest 25K is uh, in nine minutes and 37 seconds. I won't tell you by who. I'll leave that for the, the league show over on our eSports channel. Uh, but yeah, we did pretty well. We beat players like uh, Slavagoli, Deep Thought, Snowfall. Um, yeah, we beat our. We definitely beat our uh, level our two uh, Formula Two opponents. That's what I was. That's what I meant to say. Yeah, very nice. Uh, 
cool well that'll wrap it up for this video uh, a bit of a shorter one these will be because they're not moving i don't have a whole lot to go on unless we have information of course then i might have to look for it but you know uh, yeah so i hope you enjoyed uh if you liked the video hit that like button and uh let me know and i'll see you all next time take care